Welcome! It's time for another video tutorial brought to you by the Mission of Christ Network, where we show you the gear and how to make the most of your media. Once again, I'm Chris, and previously I covered shooting interesting video in my last tutorial. So today we are following it up with shooting interesting photos. The primary difference between photos and video is that video captures movement and photo captures moments. So what makes a good or interesting photograph? A good photograph has two basic parts, the subject and the background. To shoot the best images, try to capture some sort of action. Here are a couple of examples. Notice how there is the subject, which is the boat containing the lady in red, that is moving through the water. That is the action of the subject. Take note of the dynamic background. As well, it is very aesthetically engaging, especially with the contrast in the lady in red. Here is another great example. Notice how the camera subject is working on her camera, and the background is busy enough to keep it interesting. There's a perfect example of something that could be going on beside you at a bus station. It just takes one moment to shoot, but produces an engaging photograph. So when shooting photos, try to document the interesting things that are going on around you, and play around with composition, background, angles, and subject matter, but don't be afraid to experiment. A couple of things that you can play with are, as well, the time lapse and burst modes, which we covered uh, how to use in a previous tutorial. So today we've learned the difference between photos and video, we've briefly covered how to capture the best images possible. If you have any questions or comments over the video, please feel free to message me at ch at rrea.com. Thanks for tuning in and we'll see you in the next video.